Hello friend, welcome back to my channel Shafi360. This is Shafi Kul Islam. Today I will show you how to set up secure CRT in your computer. For setting secure CRT, you need secure CRT software. Here I have already secure CRT software in my PC. I have downloaded it. So here this is secure CRT software and this is key so that I can add the license key from here. For the first time you need to extract file so secure CRT just select this file and right click on your mouse and then extract file click ok now I will open secure CRT folder again just click I will click this again now I will run the application secure CRT this is the application okay just a right click or double click this application and this is the way i have already setting this software now i will delete this and uh, i will configure again okay then just uh, if you set a new session then just uh, select a session or your folder or another this time setting is a new session okay click, just click new session and you can add here your device telnet i can tell it it just host name what is the name or ip address of the remote host ip address or the name of the remote host here you can add ip address like this 10.10.100.2 okay then just click next and here you need to give the session name just uh, for your uh, recognition you can give the name names like router rt02 like this okay then just click finish okay here this is session new session uh, if i wanna create a new folder just select this and right click and uh, new folder okay new folder here you can give the folder name router r-o-u-t-e-r router like this router wait is uh, as your device name okay what type of device you are using just here i have a router and uh, this is the folder router okay just uh, you can drag and drop endpoint or okay router okay now i will include this just like this okay router router and this is the router ip address and host name here and you can also delete from here just select this one like this and delete okay are you sure you want to delete this item yes i want to delete just click yes okay this is the software secure crt uh, it has a uh, lot of uh, benefits like this you can search anything find if you want to find just click find and uh, find your session name host name description folder name like this okay just mask uh, whatever you want to search here okay and you can also copy okay some things you can also back up just just like these tools uh, create a generate a password or as in key you can also back up here in this way you can also create a, a new secure CRT here uh, in this PC I will set up secure CRT first of all I need to now open the folder secure CRT folder here I have two uh, files uh, one is secure CRT and another is key file because I wanna uh, extract here just click right click and extract no sense here just click ok it will extract here Okay, so just click uh, secure CRT folder and uh, there is a file double click again click and I will open the application here the scroll down and uh, select the application secure CRT application and you can right click uh, on your mouse or double click the option okay I will right click and run as administration click run as administration okay just in this folder option user directory okay just click ok and enter the license data you need to the key of the secure crt for this reason so you need to enter the license just click enter license data and here you need to fill out the license key and if you have the license key or you can also keep the blank is uh, but i will open the key because i have the key license key so i will go to the uh, folder or file here i will extract this uh, key just right click and extract files no sense here just click ok 
and here I will again open the key and I will again extract this uh, file and just right click and extract the file again just click OK okay now it's uh, uh, the uh, third options here showing just you need to turn off the windows defender now i will delete it and again i will extend this key uh, file and I will click ok and i will open key again i will extract this file just click on extract file for extracting the file okay now open key here it is the key for license and here is the address name company location license all the information are here just i will copy the location from the secure crt just key generator and here i will click the license key address and face to the blank site okay just right click and copy and i will paste here control plus b and next okay enter license manually i will click enter license manually here is the name copy full name just copy it and paste there control v just i will click control v again company i will copy it again and company i will paste the company okay now just here is click next and serial number license key all the information given here is serial number i will copy the serial number and again i will paste the serial number option and is the issue date it will be um, again here is license key i will uh, copy the license key select the whole file copy this and license key will paste here okay click next issue date there is issue date I will copy it and uh, I will paste here. There, features leave blank if license has no feature field. Just you need to blank it. Okay, just click next. Here is the um, status of your uh, information. Click the finished license data. Okay, I will click finish. Here, cross this because uh, I also set up the key generator, and uh, this is the first process of setting the secure CRT. Uh, it's uh, so very, very important for the network engineer because uh, we are able to use uh, Putty, but it's the more secure and more comfortable to use. So, now I will open this application, just click and drag and drop the text bar okay now i can open this from the tax menu okay just click uh, i will uh, set up the information just i can set up new session uh, here is new session i will set up the new session just here you can set up uh, telnet or other information uh, there is a lot of information okay uh, ssis ssis on telnet relays on serial you can work here just i will set up a new session just click a uh, right click and uh, new folder create a new folder and you can give the name of the folder just uh, what type of device you are using just a olt just uh, i wanna add uh, some olts of my uh, network so that's why i give the name olt here you need to set up telnet for the, the OLT. Just click next and to give the host name, IP address or remote host name. You need to set up IP address or remote host name of the device. So here I am giving IP address 172.16.22.54 and 42 one of my device so here is port number telnet port number 23 just click next and here is the session name here is the name that's why you can remember the device name so i can give the name of my uh, OLTs. so in this way you can set up the telnet process here just click finish okay now i will add another OLT. just you can add another OLT. just click the new session new session and uh, select here what types of service you wanna want just i wanna tell net just click next host name or the ip address okay remote ip address you wanna set up 172 16 254 and 46 
just click next and uh, the device name or session name you can add here for remember the device name okay click finish in this way just uh, you can add the more device or more folders or the, whatever you want you can also delete or you can find there is a lot of feature of secure crt so it's very very important for our network engineer just i will create another folder or another name just i can give the switch name as witch with it's a folder just i can add the device in this folder under this folder so just hit the ssis or telnet I'm setting telnet next and IP address of the device or remote host name. IP address of the remote host name or the host name. IP address is just like this 10 28 28 or the session name just your device name you can remember so i am giving a name of my device uh, it's the simple and very very important for a network engineer to remember or to set up this because it's very easy to use and uh, you can search the folder you can search the command from this so it's very important so, so you can search or find session name host name description folder or another you can want from there okay in this way you can set up secure crt so thank you for watching this video if you like this video please subscribe my channel and like the video and share to your friends